Gutter Rat. Gutter Rat Joey. Joey the Rat. Joey the Loser. Joey the Low Life Coward. Sneeze. Bro, remember I told you, man, I told you, I told you, like, when I first started watching you, I told you, bro, I'm never stopping. You will either get off YouTube or apologize for everything you've been saying. Tell people the truth about yourself. But either way, I'm still getting you. Trust me. That's never going away. Never. Because, you know, being racist, you thought it was just cute. Think it's cute being racist. And then trying to make, at the same time, trying to be racist, but trying to be a rapper, too. Or, or, or the second best for I'm half Mexican. You know, god dang well, you know, god dang half Mexican. I mean, that's the stuff. Burns me up. Again, just to top it off, you. The Jews. You just had to throw them in. The stars all in the same pot. So. That's never going away, bro. I'm never going to stop. Because you will apologize, bro. You are, you are going to apologize. One way or the other. Now, bro, <laughs> I have been watching you, watching you, and just like saying, like, wait a minute, man. Something is up. See, Tari, losers have to talk more because they're trying to make sure that they're not a loser. So, y'all losers have to keep talking and talking and talking. And y'all telling yourself. Y'all true characters come out. So, that's the beauty of a person like you, Rat. Because you run your mouth. You, you give it to us. You, you, you give us your true identity. I'm kind of disappointed in myself. Cause I should have figured it out a little long time ago. But, bro, you are broke as a joke. You are completely broke. You don't have no 3K. You don't have no 6K. You don't have none of that. Absolutely none of it. You are literally lying you talking about uh i get this that can get me back up to 5k i'll be almost getting uh 10k well rat you flashes 50 dollars you flash it like it's a hundred thousand dollars. Flash it out. Like, like it's just going out of style. And to carry on with you, bro. That money looked disgusting, man. Look like they were stuffed down somebody's, some dude's underwear or something, man. Or you got tips from Diddy's or something. You're sucking meat for ones or something. And, bro. You flash that money like it's like going out. I like never had it for you in your life. Bro. 
you are embarrassed that you spent ten thousand dollars and you have absolutely nothing to show for it. Nothing. You'll lose yourself. Got that money. And didn't know what to do. And acting like you was a baller. And you blew it. Blew it. You know you blew it. Everybody else knows you blew it. Except your little funky fans. They like your mini rats. They mice. They your mice. You the king rat. You... Literally spent it all in Vegas. Now, you are embarrassed because you are broke. Rat, you have not one time on here have been to the bank. And have went to the bank. Because. Rat. You. Couldn't help yourself with that money. You would show. The world. What money you got. You want to be popular so bad. It's killing you. And eventually probably is going to kill you. Because you, you were on the, you had this persona, you want this persona that people around you think you this and that, this and that. So you say, you say ignorant stuff to get people's attention. See, that's your ammo right there. Bro, you literally look like a, you look like Timmy off of freaking South Park. Timmy! You get that little, you get that little lips and big head thing rocking, bro. You are so broke. You, you, we never see you go to the bank. Never show you got deposit slips or, or um, freaking money in your hand saying I'm about to go to the bank and. I got to deposit this, man. I got to keep my money going. Keep it going. You give yourself away every day. And I just now figured it out. You give yourself away literally every time you go on YouTube. For so many reasons. One, you know you need YouTube. You have no life you have no family no no friends because these little friends on YouTube they're not your friend because they're your friend they told you the truth that you are going to hurt yourself because you're trying to live a life that you know you can't you're broke so you just keep you just keep talking and, and uh, see, uh, uh, a grown up, a grown up knows when to say enough is enough. That's what a grown up does. You've not, you will never be a grown up. Because you will never tell, be able to tell the truth about anything. Anytime somebody try to give you advice or something, you heard him be defensive and heard one shut him down. Oh, oh, you ain't reality. You ain't reality. You ain't reality. What you talking about, man? We speak reality here. No. You want your little flunkies to speak like you. But 
you are a lazy, lazy coward. You are that person that people in high school say, man, you're an a-hole, bro. Why you always got something to say? That's that's who you are, rat boy, rat sneeze. You are that guy. And you are so lazy. You literally, literally had the nerve to act like it was so bad that somebody ain't told you to get a studio apartment. And you literally couldn't even help yourself. I mean, literally said it yourself. What? Save me save me $200 a month? What's that? What's $200? Bro. You are a sad, sad. You, 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 you. You, you are so lazy. You don't want to get us to your apartment because that means you gotta, you, you gotta work more, and you gotta pay more bills, and you, 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 you can't do everything you, you do. So you gotta pay more bills, but that means you gotta work more, and your sorry self don't want to work. You're not getting checks. You know you work at Labor Ready. And you try to convince people that you are only living this life as you like the grind and the hustle. Well, if you like the grind and the hustle so much, you like having to work hard to get 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 where you gotta go by the way. But you won't take a studio apartment because you're gonna wanna have to work more. You don't wanna take a studio apartment because you're lazy and don't wanna work that hard. Because you know the rules we all know. Well, not your rap fans know that you couldn't control yourself if you had that much money gutter rat you are the poster child for being straight up no but straight up a-hole, bro. Nobody likes you. Nobody. You have no friends. No money. No car. No woman. You don't have a woman because she got smart and finally started looking past your lies that come out of your mouth. You lie about everything because you know if you tell the truth everybody know who you are and you know we will not like you whatsoever. And we don't like you whatsoever because you are nothing more than a con man. And you look so dumb doing it. You look like a guy that that literally, literally was a nobody in high school. And, but we'll probably get into a lot of fights because he always... 
Say something smart all the time. And you always got something to say negative. And everybody probably want to kick your butt. So now you are doing this crap. All this fighting. All right. Bro, you, you are the worst fighter on the planet. You are terrible. You are so terrible at everything you touch. You say all this outlandish crap, man. You know it's crap. Come on, man. Stop it. Millionaire. Come on, man. Bro, I've seen you play basketball on those all white. They look like those all white tennis shoes that just got two stripe two straps on both shoes. And some jeans and white beater. Bro, and you act like you you say about people being broke and this and that. You don't get this this and that. As you playing basketball in some all white, nameless strap tennis shoes, and some blue jeans, a white beater, and a dumb looking wave cap. Bro, you can wear that wave cap to the end of the time. Ain't nothing waving coming up on that on that head, bro. Give it up. Let it go. Bro, you you're not you're not bro. Stop saying it. It's like you just it's like any anybody try to give you any advice about something. You hurry up and get defensive because you know you know they're telling the truth on you. And instead of you taking advice like a man would do and say But you ain't a man. And you know it because you say it more than one time. I'm young, man. I'm young. I'm only 30. You're 30. <laughs> Sorry for you. You gotta run. You gotta grow up. You gotta be a man. You can't keep telling these disgusting lies and. And keep trying to get away with it. Because your excuses, your excuses is, is going to run out. Who, 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 in their mind, right mind, try their hardest to, out to, to tell somebody he don't want to take us through the apartment because it only save him $200. <laughs> it's like, you kidding me. So you rather stay in a, 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 a room. Oh, oh no, no, you said uh, uh, it ain't a hotel, it's an apartment. And it's great. Girl, stop it. Stop it. You know, god dang well. Your butt you don't want to do it because you gotta work harder. Girl, I, I must say, man, you, you are just... Every day is just like a freaking... Another stinking, rotten layer to you that gets stupider and stupider. I have never, ever in my, my life, my life had a case like this, bro. You are just embedded into yourself of the lies to keep these things going. And if people really wanted to, if people really, really wanted to figure you out, they can do it. Because you know why? You can't help but run your mouth tired. See, uh, yeah. even a rat get lucky. I said your name, so congratulations. I said your name, rap boy. I mean, you, 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 you. You try to go after every, everybody that you can try to bully. 
can't see if you how like you bully them. Cause you know you try to bully the uh, females. Females. You bully females, bro. Try to. But I think what surprised you is they fighting. You know? Frost ain't no Frost ain't go ain't sitting in the back and letting you do it. But you always pick fights with the females first. That's that, that that's your character. That's your character. Take the easy way out. That's what you do. So <laughs> I was supposed to say sorry. I told see, you got another good good moment. Hey, you know, I can say losers do get mo have good moments every now and then. Anyway, but, bro, I told you, I am relentless on you, bro. I'm relentless, and I'm not going to stop. Trust me, I'm not. Because you know what? We got enough evil in this world. And I think it's better to 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 smile, you know. I think I think people should smile once a day, man. Just smile, find something, find something in the day that just makes you, you know, makes you happy, or or or, or you know, what I mean, it, it it brings light to you, you know, because this world is just like. It's evil right now. I just think, man. One less person that is evil. Take that one less person out. I ain't trying to say the goddamn world, but I think it's a little bit funner to smile than it is to always have somebody being racist or somebody being in there for no reason whatsoever other than to get likes. That's my opinion. So, got a rat. One less evil person. This is fine by me. So, you need to stop all this lying, bro. Before you get so really hurt. Wow, you're a desperate, desperate little Timmy.